life is a casino. We don't sing, we just hit them off with c -Nos. And you can bet it all. I'm gonna be the last one standing tall. Joey Molino. What's up, Luigi? Life is a casino. We don't sing, we just hit them off with c -Nos. Tell us about And you can bet it all. I'm gonna be the last one standing tall. Joey Molino. With Joey Molino. Welcome back to episode 59, The Skinny, with Joey Merlino and Little Snuff. Today we have two special guests with us. We have Matthew Mari, a defense attorney, correct? Yes, 48 and years. 48 the best in New years York. in the business. And then the legend himself, Chuck Zito. What's up, fellas? What's up, fellas? What's, What's happening? Much. Great to see you. Thank you for coming. Great to be here. Absolutely. Thank you for coming on the show. We really Absolutely. appreciate it. There's a lot to talk about today, Joe. I roll up. And yesterday we did a live show and we told everybody that you guys were coming on the show and everybody was asking questions and asking questions. The main question is, everybody wants to hear about Donald Trump right now. Why not? So it's Our a, next he's president. He's man, ba -ba. Yeah, so it's, it's a big thing Greatest going on right now. president in my lifetime. Ever. And soon to be 47th. I can't wait. Was it three weeks till today, right? Yeah. Yeah, well, we're going to start early voting before that in almost every state. And, you know, a lot of people say that Republicans don't vote early. I, I think that, that we should because, you know, uh, you never know what's going to happen on Election Day. It might yeah. be some, something that prevents you. This is a critical election. This might be the last election ever if President Trump doesn't get elected. Yeah. And I'm concerned. I'm concerned for this country. I'm concerned for my grandchildren. I'm concerned for everyone. This is a, a must-go-to-vote election. Yeah, absolutely. And when you look around, like, it's crazy what's going on. It's uh, crazy is right. Not over here, all over the world. Yeah. I saw, I saw people uh, 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 protesting and everything, rallying for President Trump in China, right. in Japan, in England. Because yeah. they says people have to think not only in America they have to think of the world because world. he's going to change the world. There's going to be a World War Three if you yeah. don't get the fuck in. Well, you were saying that last podcast. As soon as we left, you the bombs were going yeah. on. It's the I truth. Mean, no, it's fucking crazy. I mean, it, it really is. I mean, I seen Kamala. I bought, she was on Fox last night. Did you? Did you? Oh, I never. I did never seen that, like that in my night? fucking life. I couldn't bear to try. Don't she don't answer her her. question. The guy asked her how many illegal aliens came in. She started with Trump. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Joe Biden. Uh, why didn't you know he had dementia? You were yeah. with him for four years. Yeah, Trump's got dementia. Trump's got dementia. Trump's sharpening than fucking you know, tech. When you, when I, I find it very difficult to watch uh, Kamala when her, her she's a bad visual, and she's a bad audio. Just listening to her voice kind of upsets me. But when she try, she can't speak anything of substance, and when she does speak coherently, she's always lying about Trump and it's upsetting. It's upsetting to have a presidential candidate who thinks they could get away with that. She thinks that all of us are as dumb as she is. Right. Well, well I mean, if you, she was with Biden for four years. They knew he had dementia. I knew he had dementia. Yeah. I said it three years ago. How the fuck you don't know? You yeah, were in a White House with him. Hi, this is Jimmy from A&J Flooring Kitchen and Baths. Come see us at our location Washington Township, New Jersey, serving all of South Jersey, Philadelphia, and the tri-state area. Come see us for all your kitchen needs, bath remodels, flooring, backsplashes, countertops, and anything else that we could provide. Please come see us or call us at 227-1753 or see us at our website. And she said last night about Trump, she said everything, if his administration, he's responsible for well, you're responsible for fucking Joe Biden's administration. You've been there four fucking years. What'd you do? For the last three and a half years, if you had a look, and if you're anyone with a brain, what has what have they done? Nothing. Not Nothing. A fucking they, thing. That's they, the problem. They've destroyed the country. Yeah. And and I, I, I wouldn't say it's irreparable, but you know, when President Trump gets back in office, he's only going to have four years. And and my biggest fear is that he won't be able to accomplish all that much in four years, considering the damage they've done to the structure of this country. Yeah. I don't think four years is enough for a president, though. I think eight years, seriously. Yeah. You can't yeah. fix everything in no. four fucking years. Not at I mean, all. President Trump will. No, he will, yeah. He's going to first, soon first, he, soon first he week in office. In, yeah. no, he's going to clean house, Yeah, man. he's going to clean house. Yeah. He, he's and, determined. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, absolutely. He Look, don't need it. He's a billionaire. He, he, Look, he was that, already president. Exactly. He doesn't need it. He could be sitting in Mar-a-Lago right. at his pool, right. not worry about a thing. But you know what? The man cares about Americans and America. 
And that's who he's fighting for. Right. Not himself. He's caring about you know, us. Yeah, yeah, us. The American people. His children, his grandchildren, yeah. Everybody. That's why he's doing it. Yeah. Because the grandchildren, his, his children, everything. And that's what we have to think about, the, the future of the children. I mean, like he says, she's in it four years already. She hasn't done a fucking Nothing. thing. Not one she thing. says when she's president, she's going to change it. She has the power yeah. now to change things, right. and she doesn't do shit. Right. That's what's scary. Yeah. You know? Chuck, you were, you've been around him a bunch of times. Yes, yes. And I was at the trials, and uh, I'll tell you what. I went to the trials. I couldn't believe it. The only thing missing out of the courtroom were the kangaroos. Because exactly it was it. nothing but a kangaroo courtroom. You were at that New York trial, right? That yes, motherfucking yes. judge. Judge and, Marchand. Yeah, who you been in front of but everything that he brought up president trump's lawyers sustained overruled strike that from the record everything and first of all he should never have been on the bench because his daughter works for biden yeah he donated to the biden campaign he had no business being on a bench right. we would like to thank you for watching head on over to patreon for the full episode